I'm just going to be talking about the two main ways of clicking fast on controller. Uh, Jetta and Butterfly. I'm not going to include drag because I don't know, I've never ever seen anyone drag in controller PvP. It's just like unheard of. When talking about jittering, there really isn't a whole lot to speak about. But one thing I will say though is you wanna rest your controller on your either your lap or like on a table surface because if you're just a jitter mid-air, your aim is gonna be really really bad. But apart from that, you just wanna tense up your forearm and vibrate your arm. You should be good. Guys, this is Optic, and I'm going to show you how to butterfly kick on controller. And you might be thinking, it's impossible to butterfly kick controller, right? Well, no, it's not impossible. This is the Xbox Elite Series 2 controller, the controller I use to butterfly quick with. Now, first things first, before you start, I recommend using thumb grips, as this will give you a better control over your aim when you're butterfly clicking. The second thing is, I recommend using a USB-C... USB A, whichever kind of cable you use for your controller, so you have better latency between you and your controller. I recommend using RB as this is the button I used to butterfly click with, and it's the easiest button to use when double clicking. Now, to start butterfly clicking, what I usually do is double clicking like you would on a mouse, and that's by like vibrating your finger or like bouncing your finger off, so like you click it and then it just bounces off. So it generates two clicks in one click. As you can see, my CPS counter is going like up to 10 CPS just from clicking five CPS. So once you're done with mastering double clicking, you'll be able to do something like this. Now butterfly clicking in PvP isn't really practical as it's very hard to do, especially when aiming and trying to get high CPS at the same time with double clicking. But the way I do it is I put my finger right here, just like that, and then my other finger right here, so it's kind of like this, and I put my thumb right here. So now when I start butterfly clicking, You can also aim with it, but it's not very practical because when you start aiming, you start to lose that double clicking. Sensitivity I recommend using is between 50 and 80. I used to use 51 sensitivity, so butterfly clicking and aiming was really smooth. I can go. Big thanks to Optics for helping me out with this video because I have no clue how to butterfly click. Uh, you guys should go subscribe to him, the link will be in the description. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video.